Hey up boys, in this video it's all about the jerseys. I've done another video on the jerseys which I'll link in the description because you'll need it for this video. And that's all to teach you how to put the jersey on the skin. This one is to teach you how to texture properly because I didn't do it that well in the last video so I'm just going to give it another go. And I'll use, I'll leave this in the description, the file that I'm going to use now and I'm pretty sure it's this phase jersey there we go obviously this one's got a pretty cool texture on it and you can easily just slap that on it and use it like that but for the purpose of the video I'm going to make my own so what you'll need for this video is blender obviously um, you'll need some knowledge of how to do blender I've only been doing it since the beginning of lockdown and I think I'm pretty alright and some sort of photo editing program I use Photoshop but you can use whatever the fuck you want so first thing you'll need to do for editing the texture is you'll need to click on the model go into shading then you'll see these at the bottom. You'll see like Ethmed Soccer or something. And you'll need to go to this tab over here. Click on Apex Jersey. And just image and save as. And save it to wherever you want. It's really, really quick. It's the easiest thing in the world. So after you've saved that go over to your photo editing program and you'll need to open open the file go to where you've saved it that will go open the TGA file and there you go and obviously I'm not going to do something as cool as this because I've not got a lot of time so, the easiest way to do it is if I can get, if I can find the right fucking tool, that would be class. So do you want to select this bit? And there's a number of ways to do it. There's numbers of ways to select the bit you want. S some people use tools like um, the selection tools. The magnetic lasso. I mean, you could use the magnetic lasso, but it's a bit shit. So what I'm going to use is the pen tool. You just go around. Okay, so I've selected everything and as you can see the bottom there and around the top and stuff you don't really need to be that accurate because you're not focusing on the arms unless you want to do the arms um, be as accurate as you want but we're not really focusing on the arms we're focusing on the jersey and that will not cut into the jersey so you're fine and you don't have to be skilled at Photoshop or anything to do this because it's quite easy I'm just giving I'm just showing you how I do it and you want a base color and I probably and by the way just before I forget you need to make a new layer just so you can look at the bottom one to figure out where you are um probably just gonna use black for this fuck this ever happens and you're selecting um, the outside just go into selection and then inverse and then you can select the middle bit so once you've done that all you really need to do is lower the opacity so you can see where you're going and then do like a little logo in the middle I've already got a logo um, probably I'm just gonna get the phase logo again to show you Don't know why I'm using Bing, it's just 
fucked up my computer for some reason. Just get a nice logo. This one seems alright. Save image as. And then save it to wherever you want. Go back into Photoshop, File, Place Embedded, Quick Ask this. Oh, fucked up my words for a second there. And then there you go, there's your, there's your logo. Now I'm just going to use this as a guide. So I know where to put the logo, so it looks alright and not a bit wonky. So I'm probably just going to size up a little bit. You can make, like, you don't have to be so accurate and detailed with it. You can make it as simple, as detailed as you want. I'm just going to make it simple for the purpose of the video. Um, what else can I do? Write my name. Put that in there. Like I say, this is like the easiest bit <laughs> of what you have to do with the jerseys. You'll need to watch the other video in the description to learn how to actually put the jerseys on the skin. But this is just to teach you how to do this. So yeah, you can go crazy with it. I've not put too much detail in it, as you can see. And... Yeah, I'll show you how to put that on the skin now. So what you need to do is go to File, Save As, uh, Save on your Computer. Don't save it as a PSD or a JPEG. Save it as TGA. That way it can fit onto the model. Save it anyway. I'm just gonna name it Tutorial. And then save it as JPEG work. And there you go. So once that's done, obviously you've got the jersey here. And this sometimes is the tricky bit. For this, this is laid out very nicely. Some jerseys you can get where it's all over the shop and it's got different types of nodes here and I don't know what all of them do to be honest. So what you need to do is close that, click open, go with where you've saved it and then type in what you've called it. So I've saved it as tutorial, and there you go. I've got the little logo I put on it, and my name on the back. And that is, <laughs> that's about it. That's the end of the video. If you did enjoy trying to hit 100 by Christmas, and I'd really appreciate it if you learned something new, you subscribe. Because on the last video I got a thousand views, 60 likes, and about 2 subscribers. I mean, I'm not angry, I don't care. But if you do want to learn more, and you've got some questions, put it in the comments. Because I would love to do a video on stuff you guys want. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one.